COVID clusters that have been linked to parties in both New York and Alabama. Allegations that college students, are you ready for this, are intentionally trying to get sick, even gambling on who gets the virus first. Ariel Reshef is in Rockland County, New York, with the latest on this for us. Good morning, Ariel. Hey, good morning to you, Robin. Those allegations are shocking. Officials say that those parties are causing hotspots like the one here in Rockland County as more and more young people may be contracting and spreading this virus. This morning, officials with an urgent warning after they say college students allegedly held COVID parties, knowingly attending gatherings with infected guests. College kids are having COVID parties where they're, they're getting tickets, they're buying tickets to come to the party. And then um, they will invite a couple of students that have tested positive for COVID. So if you are the first person that tests positive for COVID, then you win the money. State officials confirming that students intentionally may have spread the virus around Tuscaloosa, Alabama, and now possibly the state. Not only do the doctor's offices help confirm it, but the state confirmed they had also had the same information. In Rockland County, New York, at least eight confirmed cases allegedly linked to a house party full of 20 year olds in a suburb of New York City. It's a very uncaring attitude toward to the rest of society. Authorities say the host of the party was already symptomatic during the event and there were at least two other parties with guests in common and now officials say some of those at the party are not cooperating with contact tracers. I don't have to speak with you. Don't call me again. I will not tell you anything or I was not at the party. It doesn't matter what anyone else says. I was not there and I'm not going to speak. Authorities issuing subpoenas to nine people with possible $2,000 per day fines for noncompliance. We are deadly serious. I will not allow the, to have the help of our county compromise. It comes ahead of a holiday weekend as cases among young people are rising in many areas across the country. And officials are calling those parties both reckless and dangerous. They are urging, especially as we head into the holiday weekend, that young people abide by the CDC guidelines. Of course, that means hand hygiene, social distancing, and wearing a mask when possible. With Gambling on who catches the virus. Unbelievable. Ariel, thank you so much.